As everybody heard, YNW Millie got arrested. Murder on his mind. Let's get right into the video, man. Sure. Hold on, let me take this out. I don't know y'all. And niggas are only as loyal as their last fucking meal, bro. You ain't feed them last, expect no loyalty. But all this shit, you see all these niggas, and y'all can tell me. Look at the Takashi case. All that gang gang shit. We all this, we all that. Man, that shit don't mean nothing. Niggas be envying the nigga next to him and not liking the nigga next to him more than they be envying the ops or wanting to do something to the ops. A lot of times when I see something that happens to somebody, I look around their circle before I look at the people that don't like him. Okay? Now, there's a rapper. I actually enjoy this rapper a lot. I personally put his songs, a bunch of his songs, on my Cloud Token playlist on Spotify. Link in the description if y'all want to go check it out. But I've been really enjoying this guy's music because I think he's the hottest younger artist or up-and-coming artist musically. Blueface popping, but like some of the stuff, I don't want to call it gimmicks, but people love him on social media. This guy, people just love the music. Who am I talking about? YNW Melly. Now, he had a couple of brothers, I guess they were gang gang, all of that. And their name was YNW uh, J and there was another guy I gotta like look up his name okay uh YNW Sat Chaser okay now what happened is that those guys died and he's been saying that they got killed in a drive-by shooting okay by the way he got a documentary out he featured them heavily in the documentary they got killed like in October and by the time the documentary was finished they had died during that process so he had put an RIP in a documentary but also he has been kind of sad because his homies died now the story was he, the, his homies got killed in a drive-by shooting by the ops now they supposedly pulled up in a vehicle to the emergency room with the bodies of the guys who passed away. And the police started to do an investigation on what they thought was a drive-by shooting. They found a bunch of clues to say this ain't a drive-by shooting at all. In fact, the police then realized that this was a staged shooting. And then they started actually pointing the fingers at YMW Melly and his other friend, YMW Borton or whatever his name is, saying those. Wait, so they think they think YMW Melly killed his own bro? That's crazy if he did. Were the niggas who killed their own homies. So... Essentially, they locked up one guy yesterday, and YNW Melly turned himself in today. He's charged with a double fucking murder, bro. Double? Okay? The cops are saying they staged this crime scene to make it look like a drive-by, but in reality, they smoked their best friends. Now, I don't know if there was a... I don't know if there was an argument to happen before. I don't know if this is even true. Again, he posts his uh, message to his his Instagram saying, yo, to all my fans and supporters, no, I didn't get locked up in Washington, but I am turning myself in today. I want you guys to know I love you and appreciate every single one of y'all. A couple months ago, I lost two of my brothers by violence, and now the system wants to find justice. Unfortunately, a lot of rumors and lies are being said, but no worries. God is with me and my brother, Wine W. Board 10. And we want y'all to remember YNW family. I love you. YNW Sack Chaser and YNW Juvie. Free us. So he's locked up. Now, you know why this is sad? Because this nigga's music was going up. Fact. I mean, this guy is getting a ridiculous amount of streams. People are buying out his concert tickets. People are saying he's super talented. People are comparing <laughs> him to okay. even Young Thug. Now he's facing a double murder. And unfortunately, this might be a take case situation where we kind of know this thing might not get out. Now, maybe this is all a big misunderstanding and they charge him with murder and is he really innocent. But if this is a case where he allegedly did what the cops are saying he did and then set up a crime scene to make it seem like the ops did some shit. I ain't gonna lie, man. He gonna be going for a long time. It's very sad because I've been enjoying his music and I said, damn, this guy's going to be around killing it. I've been really researching and shit like that. For this to happen, very sad and unfortunate. Very sad and unfortunate also to the family and friends of everybody involved because, again, lives were lost. And when that happens, there ain't no way to bring that shit back. Okay? Very sad story. Uh, everybody hold their head. Why everybody getting locked up in hip-hop, man? Very sad, man. Enough of him. Comment down below if you really think he killed his own bros. Like, them is day ones. If they was, he was eating, they was eating to him, pretty sure. But rest in peace to all, 
all the homies that passed away, you feel me? I don't wish bad on nobody. Hopefully, Millie really get out. Hopefully, it's not true that he killed them or him or any of his friends killed his own brothers. Like, no, it's not blood, but you feel me? Y'all close, so one each are all E, you feel me? So, but yeah, comment down below what y'all think. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'm KJ, and welcome to the KJ Mouse Squad. Day by day to see a better day. Keep a smile on your face, take away the pain. Bounce, brr, and we out. You dig? Yeah. Zavi, Thrasher on the tee, and you know the shoes matching. I get big up, ship it out, and add the tracking. Blow a couple leaves in the sky, let's imagine. Roll it, pass it, blaze it, wrap it, get yeah, that bitch blasting. Jordan's on my feet, so you know I stay clean. Louis on a buckle, spin a band, I'm a king. Eight on my jacket, red bottoms, ripped jeans.